I wanted to vlog because Tony told me that we're going on a romantic date. I had asked if he could plan some sort of date for us. I didn't care when it was, what it was, I just wanted a date. Summer has been really busy with like family stuff, friend stuff, that we haven't really had time to do things with just us. I will take you along with me on my date. Up. This has kind of been my go-to look lately. Um, I'm using the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer and a little goes a long way. I just like to go over with a little bit of um, powder because I'm oily and I feel like it helps my oils a little bit. I'm just going to conceal some of my problem areas, my dark spots. Ignore my beauty blender. It looks dirty, but it's clean, I promise. I haven't been wearing like a lot of makeup lately. I've been pretty um, low maintenance with my makeup, which I love. I've been loving having the look of like it's my skin i haven't worn foundation in a while so i've only been wearing um the skin tint and concealer for my face but i will definitely wear foundation for like something like a formal event or something but i feel like for casual things this looks fine yeah as you can see, the pimple is still there. I'm trying to show off, but it's okay. Before concealer, I'm just gonna add this onto my eyes because sometimes it transfers to the bottom, so. I've been loving adding my um, bronzing or contour color onto my lids because it gives me the illusion of eyeshadow without me actually doing eyeshadow because I suck at it. I'm going to go in with the concealer. I don't really use anything with full coverage. It's just kind of to even out my skin tone a little bit more. I'm just going to set my under eye. My lid. I've really been liking this ColourPop blush stick. I got it for my birthday from one of my cousins. And I've just really liked the color and how it looks on my face. So I'm just going to add a little bit of that. So now I'm going to add a little bit of bronzer over my face. Give me a little color. And then I'm going to add a little bit of blush as well. This is all I have, but I kind of want to set um, that blush I had put on since it is a cream. I like to take whatever is left on my beauty blender and kind of help pat away some of those harsh lines. I do like to add a little bronzer in my crease, just to give it a little more dimension. Just something really messy. I'm just gonna add a little bit of a brown liner on my lash line. And then I take uh, a little smudge brush and just kind of smudge that. With that same brush, I want to use this kind of light brown color on my lash line. I feel like it doesn't 
look good on camera, but I like the way it looks in person. I'm gonna use some mascara. I have really short um, lashes and they grow in every direction, so it's kind of hard. I've been liking the look of my natural lash. They're imperfect like me, so. <laughs> I'm gonna do the bottom lash line also. I'm gonna use this nude um, eyeliner in my lash line. I'm just gonna take this setting powder and put it everywhere with this big brush. I'm just gonna take whatever is left on that blush brush and bring a little blush back into my lips. I love this little lip liner. I love this for me. I love using every inch of my lip liner. Well, I'm just lining my lips now. Sometimes I love a really overlined lip, but I think today keep them as they are. I'm pretty proud of myself actually. I always say I'm not going to overline and then, you know, the line just gets brought out a little bit more, but I did pretty okay today. So now I'm gonna use my favorite lip cream from NYX. That's basically my finished uh, makeup look. I just gotta do my hair and find my outfit, but, but this is basically it. A lot of skin, a lot of not matching, Okay, I'm just like talking down to myself. No, I look cute. Let's just stick with that. That was fun. So, um, yeah, there's, there's lychee drink if you want some. There's a Thai tea right here. <laughs> Calpico is what I fuck with. Uh, juice, the coconut juice. Mm -hmm. And then the other Thai tea. Yeah. What fruits did you bring? And then we got some uh, Logan and lychee up in here. Two of my favorites, and then this is a donut peach, something like that. So, why the OG one right here? Which I forgot how this one tastes. Thank you for making it. Yeah, it's with some crumbs, but you know, hey, I'll keep the flavors good. This is good. I wonder if you use more veggies. Uh huh. I think I, under I, I underestimated the veggies. These are all shrunk, huh? Yeah, I thought I had a lot. 